8.30 time for news headlines. A very good morning to you. Anglican Archbishop of Cape Town, Tabo Makoba, has called on government to focus on fixing the real problems of the country and to put aside internal party politics. Makoba says the problems include high unemployment and the energy crisis. Makoba addressed the co congregation of St. George's Cathedral in Cape Town during his annual Christmas Eve sermon. The Archbishop recently recently visited Ukraine. He has been calling on the South African government to condemn Russia's invasion of Ukraine. Makoba ended his sermon with, uh, by reminding congregates to always say a prayer for those less fortunate in South Africa, on the continent and around the world. The Gauteng Human Settlements and Infrastructure MEC Lebohang Maile says they are making a full assessment of the structural damage at the Owar Tambo Memorial Hospital in Boxburg, east of Johannesburg. This follows a deadly explosion of a gas tanker yesterday, killing nine people and injuring many others. Police have also opened an inquest docket into the circumstances around the explosion. Cricket news, where the Proteas face Australia in Melbourne for the Boxing Day Test, which starts tomorrow. Proteas fast bowler Andrich Nokia is expecting a wicket with pace and bounce at the MCG. Meanwhile, veteran Australian batter David Warner will become the 14th Australian to have played 100 matches in the format. Australia completed victory at the Gabba in two days and take a one lead into the second test. The final match will be played in Sydney from January the 4th.